Number 15. Witch Encounter This is the second time that YouTuber Franco of Franco TV has encountered this witch of the cemetery, and her presence will send chills down your spine. After entering the cemetery, he sees a light inside this monastery. A little monastery here. Wait a second. I'm getting a light on the inside. There's definitely a light on the inside, right through the window. As he continues through the mausoleums, he sees something that gives him pause. It looks like the shadow is pacing, perhaps guarding something. Franco then spots two figures at a distance. But there looks to be two people on the floor. I'm gonna see if I can record my thermal imaging camera. I'm seeing what I see. He continues on when he hears a scream. No, but it's always being desecrated. I just heard a scream. That scream gave me chills. With the thermal imaging camera on again, Franco finally spots her. Now, do you notice that the thermal imaging camera throws out these sounds, right? It's throwing out what looks like a pulse imaging uh, sound. Wait a second. I'm picking up something. A figure is peering around the corner at him. He turns the thermal cam off, but you can still see the figure clear as day. Oh my god, the thing looks like it's just peeking right out at me. I'm gonna zoom in. As Franco gets closer, she disappears. Is this figure truly a witch, as Franco believes? I think she might be, and he'd better be careful, because she's watching him. Number 14. Under the bed. Here's supposed proof that there are, in fact, monsters under the bed. Shared by YouTube channel Kisa Weba, this video is trending in the Spanish-speaking YouTube community. I was unable to track down and find the original source of this video. The short clip shows a toddler hiding under the bed. At first, she appears stuck. But after she claws her way out, this happens. What is that thing? Is it human? Or is it a demon? To me, it looks not of this world. It must be from the land of pure nightmare fuel, sourced from this child's fear. Number 13. Edinburgh Manor Located in Iowa, Edinburgh Manor is a haunted estate in the middle of nowhere. Redditor Topher Photo shares this footage of their investigation into the place. Listen closely and you can hear voices. The Redditor left their camera in the house, so some in the comments think they were simply humans trespassing. But the Redditor says the place was completely locked up, and there's no way in, and others are suggesting the frequency of the voices isn't human.
Maybe whatever this is isn't human. Considering this audio analysis and other first-hand accounts, in the comments, about Edinburgh Manor's haunted reputation, I feel that this place is the real deal. Number 12. Mexico Ghost A camera with motion detection recorded an interesting anomaly in a garage in Mexico. Redditor Oscar Burlsich shares the capture. A semi-transparent object appears to move across the front of the garage. Many in the comments are mystified, but not in the way you think. Many even point out that the reflection appears to be in line with a red car passing by down the street. While I want to believe, I tend to agree with the commenters that think this figure-like anomaly is just a reflection. Then again, simple explanations like this have been known to be wrong a time or two. Number 11. Poltergeist Activity This supposed poltergeist activity will make you jump out of your skin. YouTuber Chanda Lee Jot Official is exploring an abandoned building at night when he hears this noise. He looks around but finds nothing. Here it is again. I'm not sure what is there, but I would assume by the energy that this entity is incredibly powerful. Number 10. Oh Cursed House Did the YouTube team Ghost Trip Investigation just summon a demon? In the Oh Cursed House in Derby? See for yourself. Are there any child spirits that would like to come and speak with me? I'm coming. Yeah. Did you hear that? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right, now, now I'm... They capture an EVP as they're looking up at the house. Tell me why. Can you show yourself at that window? It apparently is watching them. When they head down into the cellar, they're told who is watching. I think I'd be packing it in for the night, because it seems to me like a demon is stalking them. Number 9. Haunted House After living in her haunted house for 8 years, Redditor Mara underscore Bell 30 sister still gets shook when stuff like this happens. Some in the comments are finding the humor in this scary ordeal. After a while, the Redditor's sister gets up to go check it out. and the sound just stops. Many in the comments are suggesting the knocking is the pipes, but I don't think so. I think this is a terribly obnoxious ghost. Number 8. Ghosts in Abandoned House There are supposedly ghosts in this abandoned house, and the YouTube team Toppy is here to unearth them. As they search the place, they hear something in the next room. The door is closed, and they just heard footsteps. As they get ready to use the spirit box, they hear another unexplained noise.
A second camera captures the noise in the kitchen. Watching the film back from before and after the camera fell, they see that everything on the table has been moved. As they again attempt to interact with the spirits here via the spirit box, one of the crew feels something. He says it felt as though something was putting its hand on his back. There's a ghost here. It seems like there's a ghost here, reaching out, and I'm not sure if they should reach back, because they can't be certain it doesn't have ill intentions. Number 7. Corganville House The Corganville House in Simi Valley is apparently haunted and YouTube Team Ghost Club Paranormal's investigation is starting off with bad omens. Just reviewing the footage of when we first came in here, um, that bark was on that tree, and, and what was the first thing that she done when she brought us in here? She was like, look at this tree. I was like, that's a gorgeous tree. They hear a noise, and it looks like the bark broke away from the tree. That's, I don't know if that's what that noise was. Imagine if we were standing under there. This is like a weird, I don't know if you want to call it omen or whatever, and I know you guys are probably thinking it's just a tree. As the investigation continues, they capture this EVP on camera. During an estate session, they get some answers. If that's the child that we're speaking to right now, can you give us a possible name? Emma. Emma. That's my E. Okay. Emma. Cool. Oh my. You heard me. Yes, I know we did we hear you, you. We Emma. Heard you. I thought it was thank Emily, you. but thank you. We appreciate you saying that. And that's why some YouTubers in the comments are considering that maybe the energy setting off their K2 meter is Emma. She watches over your house for you. I'm just doing a quick sweep of here. Oh my. What? Where? Are they going through us or in us or something? They might be near you. Not through you. Like nothing with you. I think this might be the right assessment. Emma is trying to tell them something, and she seems very afraid. Number six, Slaughterhouse Butcher. A phantom slaughterhouse butcher put YouTuber Outdoor Zhao Long in the freezer, and this is how it all began. As he moves through the slaughterhouse, something starts making noise. In another hallway, objects come to life. Back in this room, he hears more noise. And then more movement. In my opinion, there's definitely something in here with him. And it looks like it wants to lock him in for intentions that can only be nefarious. Number 5. Overland Hotel In one of the most haunted towns in the world, YouTube team Twin Paranormal is investigating the infamous Overland Hotel. As the team is setting up and explaining their devices to the spirits, they instantly respond. We have these other devices that allow you to use words. Basically, it has a two. That was two. 
Can you do that again? Yo, that was fast. Yeah. yeah. They soon discover they're dealing with a dark entity. G. Now you're producing. This is dangerous. This is dangerous. Don't be afraid of us. We are not here to harm anybody, nor get rid of them. We would like for you to feel- In the air. In the air. Whoa. As they're communicating through a spirit box, something reaches out closer to home. What the f That was a voice. That was definitely a voice. I heard that. I'm gonna go. They understand that they're speaking to more than one entity. We're gonna have to move on. We have other rooms in this hotel. Basement. Basement. Oh. That's what Exactly. Is that where it all happened? In the day. In the day. It happened during the- The spirit seems to be telling them something. Sound. Oh, oh dude. That was four. Dude, guys, who what the f before we left room 10? Remember, it said four, four spirits. spirits. Shadow man. Shadow man. Then this happens. Joking, dude. Walk away, please. Dude, whoa. Seven spirits. Seven spirits? This place has for sure got a story to tell, and it looks to me that the twin paranormal team is on the way to solving the mystery. Number four, Rockabye. This ghost will rock you to sleep. YouTuber Magical Poltergeist shares footage of poltergeist activity in their home. It seems to have woken them up in the night. Just watch. And when the resident comes out to have a look, he is sent fleeing. Did you see it? As the rocking chair stops, the dining room chair pulls out from the table. If you ask me, these residents are in big trouble. This poltergeist is growing more and more powerful by the minute. Number three, office ghost. I'll bet you wish your office was this exciting. YouTuber, Abimenu, Sisodia shares this video originally posted by TikToker Mac1424. At first, the office looks just plain boring. But when one of the office workers gets up to leave, things get wild. Watch his chair. First, it turns a little, like normal, but then, it takes off in a completely unnatural way. What do you make of this? Well, many in the comments think someone under the desk pushed it. I'd like to believe this was an office prank, and that the prankster is a poltergeist. Number 2. Dorchester Prison YouTuber CVS Paranormal Vicky enters Dorchester Prison and straight away something is off. And the microphone's in here and the torch is flashing. Oh, oh look, the torch is flashing, yeah. So we've only just we've been here about five minutes. Now that's bizarre. As they continue on, they start hearing noises. I can I I heard I heard something. Oh, what the f was that? I don't know. And then things get musical. Oh, my goodness me, this place. <gasps> yeah, that was. Is this poltergeist keeping Dorchester Prison lively? It sure sounds like it to me. It's flickering the flashlight like a strobe light, and it's playing music. If this is what the afterlife is like at Dorchester Prison, 
then it seems way better than the other haunted prisons I've talked about over the years. I've got a challenge for you. Since you've made it this far, why not like this video and hit subscribe in the next 5 seconds? Because I upload 4 new scary videos every week. If you're curious about what I look like in real life, then go to my Instagram at DylanIsChillinYT and tap that follow button to find out. Number 1. Blair Witch House YouTuber Carlos the Fam visits the Blair Witch House alone, and he soon regrets it. It took me like 15 minutes to get walked through the woods just to find the, find the home. What the? As Carlos continues his tour of the home, he keeps hearing things. cannot harm me. I'm protected by Jesus." At first, I thought he was being paranoid, but a presence definitely seems to be there. You don't have to be so... Oh, what the whoa, 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 whoa. As he prepares to bless the home, he hears footsteps. I'm gonna burn some sage in here. I'm gonna bless this home. You cannot do this! He returns to the sage, but then this happens. Do not let anything attach to me. Carlos burns the sage around the house, but whatever is here isn't going away. Nothing in here. No one in here. No. Oh, sh Oh, why am I? Okay. The is it the actual Blair Witch? So this place is freaking insane. Okay. Oh! Holy crap! The glass. I don't know what it is, but I do know it's devastating my dreams. Have you ever seen a video that crossed the threshold of too scary to watch? Well, I've come across dozens of them. These are 30 scary videos I almost can't show you.